Welcome back to Android Q&A. My name is Jason. This is where we try and answer your most pressing Android questions, like Google Play services stopped. What do I do? It's okay. We've got you covered. So some of you may be in the same position as Naveen where you receive this message. My phone keeps getting this message. Unfortunately, Google Play services has stopped. What do I do? Well, all you have to do is follow these simple steps. First, go to Settings, then Application Manager, then Google Play Store, and then select Uninstall Updates. After that, reboot your device. If that does not work for you, Naveen, you can check out the link below where there's a number of different options to solve that problem. Good luck. Next question is all about how to put your phone into recovery mode. Hello Jace, how can I reset my Galaxy S3 to stock recovery? I'm using Clockwork Mod and my phone is rooted. Well, Bahar, entering recovery mode in a Galaxy S3 is pretty easy. All you have to do is shut down your device and while booting, hold the volume button up, the home button, and the power button simultaneously. There's a video in the description below that shows you exactly how to do it. Next question deals with those who really want a good smartphone but have a serious budget. Hey Jace, people talk about flagship phones a lot, but what do you think is the best budget phone? Maybe around $100. Recently, we've seen an impressive wave of smartphones for both entry-level and mid-tier phones from Alcatel, specifically the Alcatel One Touch Hero and the One Touch Idol lines. Now, depending on where you live, this phone may cost more than $100, but it just goes to show Alcatel is really helping the market mature and providing decent smartphones on a budget. And for me, I think this is really exciting because in the near future, we may be able to buy entry-level or mid-tier phones, you know, two or $300, and buy a new one each year and not have to be wedded to a carrier because the only decent phone available was a $700 phone. That's good news for all of us. So the next question deals with how to restore storage to a new phone. My friend Pierre asks, what is the best way to restore apps after making a clean installation? So I do this thing quite often. I'll just reset my phone, you know, three or four times a year to speed it up. If I've got too much gunk on it, I'll just do a factory reset. Now, the easiest straightforward way to do this is just install Titanium Backup. Now, Titanium Backup is not uh, a sponsor here. I'm not necessarily trying to pimp their app, but it's just so simple and straightforward. So after I do a factory reset, I don't have to install apps individually. I don't have to transfer music back or my podcasts or audiobooks. And believe me, those things are very important to me. I just did a factory reset a couple days ago and it just kind of all went back to uh, the way I originally had it. I like that. Good stuff. Check out Titanium Backup. It has great reviews. It'll save you some headaches. Thanks for watching Android Army. My name is Jace and I know many of you will be anticipating to find out who won the t-shirt uh, contest question from last week where I asked about the original inspiration for the uh, smartwatch, a true smartwatch, and I was referring to an obscure, at least I thought was an obscure cartoon from 30 years ago called uh, Battle of the Planets and the team was called the G-Force. And uh, it was hard to ascertain actually who answered the question first because we had so many questions come in right after the video went live via Twitter, uh, Google Plus, and uh, YouTube comments. So I did my best to uh, ascertain who was first. And the first answer that I can find was correct was six minutes after the video went live. And that was from Michael Francis. So Michael, you can get in contact with me and I will uh, send you a t-shirt wherever you live in the world. You know the drill. You don't want to forget about my brothers in Android, Josh, Joe, and the Tech Ninja, Kevin, and Chris. Now, if you didn't win this week's t-shirt, there will be another Q&A coming out later this week where I have another question for all you Android aficionados. Connect with me here on Google Plus or Twitter. I read everything. All the at replies, all comments, all that kind of stuff. And I shall see you later on this week on Android Q&A.